hello guys so welcome to my channel um in this video i'm going to show you how to check your plagiarism score using turnitin so first just go to your google browser and type sakai so it's this for university of ghana student just type eugene sakai okay <laughs> so you go to the first link that shows up and there a page will um, appear where you have to log in so you log in um, with your credentials, that's your Eugene ID and then your password. Okay. <clears throat> so after doing that, the Sakai page will open. Um, and on that portal, you have to follow these steps carefully. So as we wait for it to load, make sure you like, subscribe, and then share to your colleagues okay so you have to go to a uh, membership okay make sure you follow the step uh, carefully and then here you need to select joinable sites okay joinable sites and there you select outcome there's a site the website called outcome this one yes join click on join now then after that, you go back to um, this tab, okay, this panel. You see outcome 100, 1, S2, yeah, then you click on that. So that outcome page will open. So when that opens, it means that you're actually part of that um, class or that um, website. So you go to assignments here. After clicking outcome, you go to assignments. Then at assignments, make sure that you select the current date. So today is um, 17. So I need to select the, the, the range 16th to 31st. So you click on that. So you're saying not started and all that. So at this point, this is where you select the file. So you can either uh, upload the file as a PDF or Word, but I like to use PDF. Um, so now, it says here that the number of resubmissions allowed unlimited, accept a resubmission until 31st blah 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 status not started and grade scale no grade so after submitting and then uh it being processed by turn it in, in sakai a grade scale will appear here there'll be a flag and then a percentage so when that happens you click on the flag that shows that um, that will show you your turn it in report but we are not there yet so here select from your computer choose file then I'll choose my file, dissertation by Katechie Kofi Korea. So I'll select that. Then open. So the file will load here. Now, after loading here, make sure you save the draft first. And then you click on... Okay, so after saving the draft, it automatically um, uploaded. So it says that you have successfully saved your work, but not submitted yet. So make sure that you submit. That's very important. Um... To complete submission, you must select the submit button. Okay, so I'll go back. Click here and then. So this is the file. Then after that, you have to click on proceed. Okay, proceed. Now, it said if you're ready to submit, and, uh, submit a completed assignment, click submit. So now you click on submit to make sure you submitted. Otherwise, it won't process for you. All right, so I've submitted my work. <laughs> now, when the when it is done, okay, a flag a flag sign will show. This here, it says no grade and it's, it's pending. So when it is done, okay, it may take 24 hours, 12 hours. It depends on the traffic, or even less than 12 hours. It depends on the traffic that the site is um, having. So here, there will be a grade shown here, and then there will be a flag. So you click on the flag when it's done. All right, so I'll show you when it's done. Thank you for watching. Make sure you like, subscribe, and then turn on your notifications. Thank you so much. Bye. See you in the next video.